Hello, welcome back. So this is the first mission where we are not handhold by the tutorial. Now, I don't know what is the better one because this is a, the problem of the game for newer players. It doesn't specifically say what it's used for because all items are used for something but it's not going to be revealed to you. I guess you just have to fulfill the orders the best way you can. Blight root footprint. Oh, so they also generate blight root. Hmm, interesting. Specialization bonus cloth. Lumber mill specialization is wood. It's fun just to look at the, what the various things do, but meat production and cloth. Oil. I don't have oil. Okay, they are good at farming and enjoy brewing. Woodworkers and enjoy engineering. Like warm environments. Animals and meat production. Hmm. Okay, so I guess it's a little bit weird. So in the beginning you don't get a lot of information about what you are going to... Oh, we have new road, paved road. Stone, where is the stone? We don't have any stone, right? Oh, okay, so I guess not all the time you'll have all of the resources available to you. And we have to expand in what direction? Oh, <laughs> so dangerous. I guess this direction and that direction will be the woodcutter. And like I said, I should probably build the road all the way over there. Now also, I don't like that you cannot see all of your resources on screen. I guess you can click on here and you'll see you have 40 wood, so that means we'll need... Of course the woodcutter camp. Which costs... Oh, I guess it only costs gears, not wood, so I can build a lot of them. Relatively easy. I guess first of all I have to plan the roads. And the more I understand about playing, better the more I'll do it. Sacrificing goods. Or to decrease hostility, sacrifice panel or resource you want to burn. So hostility of the forest, it's okay. Harvester is good for meat as well, no. Scavenger is the one that... Is good for the eggs as well, okay. Paved road, I guess this will be a little better. I'm curious if this works better because they'll have little bit of better moving speed. Huh. How did they build this one faster? I guess here we'll just have to have lizard man and lizard man. <laughs> and I guess that will be the basic things we need for the start of the game. Now I think we have to build some shelters as well. How much does a shelter cost? Wood. 30 wood. Is the shelter really needed? Oh, good camper. 
boot camp uh, they work faster. I guess we have to wait until we see the first orders before we decide what we pick. Since again, I think they'll just eat raw food or raw items, but they don't need a lot. I suppose we can build them on this side as well, so three of them should be more than enough. And I'll not build near the warehouse, because this is where we'll build uh, the production facilities. And now we only have one human that will build them. I guess it's okay. Doesn't really say how much wood they need or how much wood they use per minute or... Pick an order, well... <laughs> Is it important or...? Discover free glades, I guess we'll pick that one, discover free glades. Solve two glade events, I'm not sure if we'll get the events good sold. I guess for that we need a merchant, but we get tools. I'm not sure about the glade events, we'll just pick the one with the... <sighs> trading bonus. Beaver and humans. I think this will be harder to do because we'll not get a lot of... the Queen's perk, Queen's grace or whatever it's called. Pack of crops. In the makeshift post, okay. I haven't discovered anything interesting yet, so I guess we can increase the speed of the game. Hmm, I wish we could see how m what resources you have over there. No, no picking blueprints. So what is this? Queen's Impatience, Blueprint Reward... <laughs> I'm so afraid I'll pick the wrong thing. Yes, I don't need any of those just yet. See of fertile soil, abandoned cash. Chose a reward. Wait, one of the things I needed is to sell item. I guess. I guess I'll have to sell at least 8 Amber, and I'll have 4 Amber. So I guess that will not be worth it. I guess we'll get that other one. And I guess we'll have to investigate that glade as well. Now as for food. Farm field. Wait, where is my farm? Wait, I don't understand. So we can build a farm field. I don't have a farm available, so what's the point? I guess there is no point from what I can see. Okay, I guess I'm, I'm missing some information about the gameplay style, and this is. Hmm, that's kind of annoying. 
I guess I should more or less move them all the time like that. Where are they idle? Probably because they don't have enough workers available. Why are they idle? I don't understand. I guess I understand some of the mechanics, but not all of them. I guess I cannot build a farm, so what would be the point in trying? Yeah, some of the mechanics are so badly explained. I require simple tools, six simple tools. Do we have six simple tools? No, we don't have simple tools. And that's why they don't work, but they don't tell you this. Warning, no tools to open. Man. I don't see any source of food, to be honest. We'll have to cut down that area next. What am I doing over here? No, 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 no. I disapprove of this. I strongly disapprove of that. Oh, it's not even in the range, but how? I guess sometimes it's a lot of moving around. We don't want the bad, big bad glaive to be woken up. I guess our food supplies are getting kind of low. Okay, let's increase speed. Yeah, you don't get a lot of information, that's what bothers me. I guess they didn't want to simplify certain things, but... Other things are just too complicated now. You know what, I think I'll just pick something, and that will be it. So that... Scrolls... F7 is our people. I guess we'll take the Weaver. Hmm, so they can get a grain, really? Okay, I guess I'll, I'll wait a little longer until they unlock these two blades to see what resources we have. So we can collect the grain. No, that's not even grain. No one is homeless. Now we're in the bad season. Our hostility is rising quite fast. And we're not even close to finishing one or two of these. Eggs and roots. I guess we'll just remove everyone from there. Oh, I can see the problem now. Okay, can I just move this over here? Yes, I can. <laughs> That's kind of annoying that you cannot get the, the farm as one of the first buildings. Well, I guess that's the entire challenge then. Okay, just go fast forward. 
I think this is how people are playing the game, just put it on two speed. Mushrooms and more fertile soil. Oh, I need a herbalist camp for that one. And that's the stonecutter camp. Hmm. Interesting and bad at the same time. So I guess some glades you just don't have anything to do, or you don't want to do anything with them. Oats. I guess we need to produce those things. But for us to produce bricks, we need clay. And we don't have any clay. Okay, this is getting super annoying. Super annoying. Uh, well, how do you do it? And we don't even have plant fiber. Plant fiber is not obtainable from these things I have over... Oh, we have plant fiber, okay. Which can give us some clay as well. So that means we need what? Harvester camp, okay. So while those things, oh, those things are building, we'll have to... Okay, let's just pick more bull... Voila. Let's just pick more blueprints. I don't want the herbalist camp, but I guess I'll have no other choice because the trappers are the ones that I want. So this can gather what? Roots and eggs. So I guess I should pick something that doesn't get roots or eggs. Herbalist. Can you accidentally... I guess that's why a lot of people are just having a lot of problems because of this. Ah, let's just pick the leather worker. I don't care. Cannot re roll. I sincerely don't know what those things do. Herbalist. Oh, I guess it's good that they show you what you can collect with the herbalist. It's so far away though. I have no choice. I think I made a few mistakes along the way. Yeah, we should be okay. We should be solving one of the requirements. I'm not sure when the traders will arrive. Other worker, but I don't have any of the other stuff. I guess you always need to have the crude workshop or the crude workstation. <sighs> now I gave the root deposits and the storm. Okay. Go 
collect everything and this time we'll do a better job at clearing the trees. I don't think we can go to another glade because everything is dangerous around us. Except for that one over there. But I guess we can wait a little bit. We deliver and we get a new... <laughs> Finally we get the farm. Well, I guess we have to put it over here so we get the full benefit of it. Does priority matter if it's the only building built? Eh, yeah, more or less. I guess we're a little short on workers. Let's put the lizardman to work over there. It has! It doesn't because I destroyed them. Okay, so I guess you should build the farm fields as soon as you can because at some point you don't have enough people. Yeah. So we have the fibers, we also probably have some clay at least. We don't have any clay. We have some clay where you can produce the bricks now. Okay, let me see. The pack of crops is made where? Makeshift post. I have a makeshift post. Granary and brewery. I guess we can make the makeshift pose, but we'll not think too much about it. I guess we can just build it and leave it like that for later. Why are these guys still homeless? Is this not a priority for them? I guess we have no available workers then. I'll just move that one there so I know where to take it and this one will have to move over here because I know I need them over there. Well, I guess I shouldn't really take people from the buildings that produce food. I guess I always want to have a lot of workers, but I don't have a lot of workers, so that's slowing me down a little bit. So this is the problem I am seeing right now. I don't have any build builders. So that means no one can build my buildings or <laughs> make my crop fields. Farm fields. Okay, I have to be more careful with my worker assignment. Looks like they're not doing too badly. The result is 15 or 10. Oh yeah, that's helpful, but it, I don't think it's that helpful in the long run. We have broccoli patches, really. Small encampment. So this needs vegetables. We can send it to the citadel or welcome new people. Oh, welcome new people. That will just idle, yes? Yes. Broccoli patches need what to be harvested? Forager camp. Oh, I don't have a forager camp. What?
I can see the problems, so I guess the problem is you don't have the right buildings for the right job, more or less. So I guess we cannot use anything from here, vegetables. Because the farm is not producing what I want. I guess we can put them to create only vegetables and that will help us with that task. I have a feeling I need to build a trading post for the <laughs> trader to arrive. Yeah, let's just build that. I need to be a lot more careful with my worker management, so does this do anything? No, I guess if it doesn't have worker, it doesn't do anything. I have to move this over here. I guess I'll just leave it at that. And they can cut the wood from there. Okay, so the trees have a chance to give a lot of things, apparently, even food, so that's what I was missing. So it's in the... we're in the drizzle. Looks like it takes quite a long time to get vegetables. Trader arrived. Don't give away all of my wood. Apparently wood is a very good resource to give away. Oh, and I can just buy the vegetables. So buy six vegetables. Anything else I need? Oh yeah, I forgot I need the amber. No, not all of it. Four. So I need 4 Amber, a uh, Gold Sold and Pack of Crops. Uh, I can see some problems I guess. Okay. Okay, we'll sell half of our wood because apparently it's not such an important resource. I'm joking, it's very important but I don't think we need that much right now. Uh, this is a bit annoying, so six of that, four of that, and I guess the rest can be food, or maybe we need a grain. I guess we can just buy leather with the rest of the money. That should solve technically the problems. Oh. Now about this one, I will need someone over here to make a pack of crops, but for that I need the herbs. Oh, I need herbs, but I should have herbs. Come on game, don't lie to me. I don't have the herbs. How do you get the herbs then? I haven't... I have her, the... oh, that's not the herbalist. That's a herbalist, but where do you get the... <laughs> the herbs?
It will just idle, okay. Let, let's not do anything over there. Green, I think I should pick the easier ones because remember, this is not a very hard or long mission, so... Pick easy stuff that I can do. Smokehouse, from what I can see, is one of the best buildings in the game. I guess I should start clearing the bigger claves near me because I don't have anything else to do. Okay, this is very cool. I think I'm enjoying it a lot. Now, I will stop the video right here. I don't want the episodes to get too long, but... Yeah, it's, it's a lot of memory work. You have to remember what each building does and what do you need to do to get the resources you need. And looks like this will be one of the longer missions. I guess I have to solve the missions a lot faster. Hmm, it's an interesting game. See you next time. Bye. Uh, actually, before I leave, I want to check something else. So the traders... Oh yeah, they're on a timer here. We have trading routes and consumption control. Very interesting. See you next time. Bye.